There are a few methods to cast on stitches for your project. This method is the long tail cast on and I will show you just how to do that. We're going to have to leave a tail long enough for about 20 to 30 stitches. So you're going to have to assume how many stitches you will need and leave enough tail for that. Hence the uh, name of the method long tail cast on. The first stitch is always the slip knot and to make it just wrap the yarn around your two fingers and pull it through and this is the slip knot. Now we'll need some needle and uh, uh, wrap it around the needle and just tighten it up. So that's the first stitch. This is the short end of the yarn and this is the rest of the yarn. What I'm going to do is wrap the short end around my thumb right there and um, the long tail or the yarn on my forefinger um, or pointer whatever that one is okay so right now what we're gonna do is go with the needle um, under the yarn um, of the thumb or the one that's on the thumb and then pull this one through releasing the yarn on the thumb and grabbing it again and tighten it up. So here we go again. Go under, grab it, release it, tighten it up, bringing the yarn again around the thumb. And continue to cast on like that. I'm gonna show it again in slow motion short end wrapped around thumb long tail go under grab the long tail and tighten it up and just like that I'm gonna keep going and cast on the amount of stitches that I need for my project.